My name is Fleur. I, um, I heard you wanted a model on your, uh, on your, on your post. Mm-hmm. On, uh, on a giggle? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, you said you wanted a skunk model? Mm-hmm. Why am I here so early? Uh, well, you, in your post, you didn't specify how early you wanted, uh, you, you wanted, uh, your model to be here. So, um, I woke up at three in the morning. I, uh, got myself a V8 sparkling energy and, uh, uh, here we are. Um, I, uh, I, I hope I'm wearing something uh, suitable for, for the modeling. Uh, you, you didn't specify what kind of, uh, model you wanted. Like, what sort of aesthetical model you wanted. So, um, uh, I, I hope I'm satisfactory, though. I, I'm new to modeling, but I, I'm really dedicated and passionate about the craft. Just tell me how you want me to pose, or model me as like pose me as you see fit and I will hold that pose for as long as you need me to I, I promise I'll be a very very good model for you uh, human uh, by the way um what is your name uh please oh oh that's a really good name I, I like it so oh my outfit is fine okay um, how would you like me to pose? What art medium are you using? Ah, I see. So, you want me to pose like this, holding the empty wine glass? Hmm? Hmm. Ah, uh, the wires are buzzing again. <clears throat> it sounds like, uh, Someone is in the computer room. Mm. They really ought to get some some sprites on that. Oh, don't worry. I won't move a single muscle while you work. <laughs> so how long have you been an artist for? What's your art medium type? Uh, the buzzing does not work first. Ugh. Intercom again. Damn it. I hate those loud sounds. Uh, I wonder who they want now buzzing the intercom like that. It's so annoying. Don't worry though. I promise I won't move a muscle. Even though the, the static in the air is making my first hit on end. Mm -hmm. That's better. Um, uh, it sounds like the intercom was to get the sprites on the, uh, on the electrical issue. Um, I, I hate to, I hate to ask, um, but would it be alright if I, uh, if I just smoothed out my fur a little bit? I, I know I said I wouldn't move despite anything, but, um, I, uh, I, I, I worry that my, my fur that kind of got stuck up on end might, uh, might hinder your, uh, your vision, your art, your inspiration. Hmm? You are okay with my fur being a little on end? Um, alrighty. Oh. You're using pencils? And later watercolor? Oh dear. <sighs> the headmasters must really want to talk to someone. It's twice now that the intercom's buzzed. My goodness gracious. 
Um. Hmm. Oh. Um. Yeah. I. Uh, I go to this university too. <clears throat> Hmm? Oh, um, I, uh, I'm studying songwriting, and, uh, I'm also working on, uh, on getting my English, my English majors. Mm-hmm. I'm studying poetry and, uh, and, uh, storytelling as well, along with songwriting. Well, I find that storytelling and songwriting in and of itself are very important tools, not just for humans, but for monsters and beast folk alike, since they're a form of storytelling, and in that sense, they're a form of immortality, because we live on by the word of mouth through others, if that makes sense. And when the time comes, I want to be able to uh, help others achieve their immortality by word of mouth and in song and poetry and stuff. Um, <clears throat> if that makes sense to you, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I've tried saying, I've tried talking about this with uh, my roommates and such, and uh, to them it sounds like I'm speaking, I'm speaking Berzee or, you know, forest talk. It, they, they don't understand me. <laughs> oh. Well, I, uh, I'm glad you get it. I, well, as they say, birds of a feather flock together, but, um, well, I, I, I don't know where I was going with that, um, hmm? oh, uh, you're welcome. I, I probably would have done the same thing. I, like, you, uh, what I mean is you would have done the same thing for me had I have been in your shoes and you, you'd have been in mine and... Uh, wow. I'm sorry, I'm muttering. But, um, I'm happy to help. And besides, I can only become a great model if I get all the practice in, you know? <laughs> <clears throat> so, um, tell me, aside from being an art student, um, what are you studying for? What do you want to be when you grow up? <laughs> I know it sounds a little childish, but humor me a little bit. I mean, just because I'm modeling with, I'm modeling for you doesn't mean we can't make polite conversation while we both work. <laughs> oh, that's really interesting. Hmm. You wish to, uh, to become a, uh, a guard at a museum. An art museum. Well, that's very interesting. <clears throat> um. Oh. That's your second option. To run a shop that sells antiques and vintage things. Well, that's also a very creative option. Well, I think you can do whatever you set your mind to. <laughs> I mean, I speak a little bit from experience, as well as, you know, learning from the past. Hmm? History? Oh, well, we skunks have always had a mixed reputation. Well... We're famed for our, uh, our, um, our, um, you know, one scent. Get it? <laughs> it's a smell joke. <laughs> uh, but, um, yeah, Pepe Le Pew is kind of accurate, but I mean, you know, all skunks are different, but, I mean, well, there's also the fairy tales involving, uh, you know, the animal bride or animal bridegroom. Uh, the skunk bright fairy tales are often, well, uh, <laughs> uh, we're hopeless romantics. Kind of like how mermaids, for the most part, really love the little mermaid. 
But, um, what do I want to do with my life? Well, I want to be an art model. Well, as well as a storyteller. I mean, I could do both. Write stories and poems. And, uh, model on the side or something. I could do both. I, I'm definitely determined enough. But I want to be able to inspire others. And besides, with the Interspecies Exchange Bill in effect, I mean, I want to be able to try everything. Within reason, of course. I'm, I'm glad you reached out for a skunk model. How, how is it coming along? Hmm? Oh dear. Oh, my first starting to stand up on end again. Uh, the headmaster's gonna have to call up those sprites again t to work on the static issue. Mm -hmm. I'm starting to make my first stand up on end. Uh, uh, I. You're almost done? Are you sure? I don't want to rush you. Mm. Well, I mean, if the the static electricity keeps fluttering in the air like this because people are in the computer lab and uh, someone's trying an experiment of some sort, um, well then my fur will just keep standing on end until I'm all super fuzzy, like uh, like I came out of a dryer machine. Mm-hmm. I, I, I can hold on, I promise I will, but, um, you're sure I'm not rushing you? All right, if you're sure. I'd hate to interrupt your artistic flow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Starting to make my first in on end on my tail. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. Thank you again, though, for, for the opportunity to model. I appreciate it. Ugh. Damn static electricity. Mm. Ah. It sounds like the sprites got the, uh, got the static finally under control. So, um, how did it turn out? Can I see, please? Oh, wow. Wow. That's very well done. You're a great talent. No, I'm serious. I really am. This is really well done. This belongs in an art gallery. I'm serious. I think you should submit this uh, to that art contest. Mm -hmm. I know they'll certainly appreciate good talent. I mean, true art is subjective, but still, this is very good. And I, I think there will be at least some people who are able to appreciate your artistic talent. This is really well done. Uh, thank you again for having me as your model. I appreciate it now. Now that I'm, I'm no longer modeling, uh, I gotta smooth out my fur. Mm. Uh, the static electricity doesn't really... Well, I mean, it is a bit of a nuisance with my fur standing on end, but, uh... Well, um... Let's just say, uh... A skunk's tail is particularly sensitive. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh... I, I've been, well, I've, I've secretly been considering getting my, uh, my scent glands removed. Uh-huh, if I don't have my scent glands, then I don't smell skunk, I, I won't, I won't be able to spray and then I won't smell skunky, even though I, uh, I, I don't usually smell skunky, um, well, uh, oh dear, I'm getting all flustered, I'm sorry. I'm fine just the way I am. Well, well, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, uh, are you, uh, um, doing anything later? 
Well, um, I, uh, I wanted to, uh, I, I wanted to take you out for lunch. Uh-huh, my treat, as a, as a way of saying thank you. I, I enjoyed modeling for you, and, well, I'd like to get to know you a bit better, if that's okay with you. Alrighty. Um, just let me get changed into a different outfit, and, um, we can, we can go to lunch. There's this nice little cafe nearby. Mm-hmm. Oh, you'd like me to model for you again? Um, I, I'd like that very much. Um, but yeah, let's, let's head back to our dorms and then, um, um, uh, meet me by the library doors and, uh, we can go to lunch. Alrighty. I'll see you then. See you then. Mm-hmm.